Ladies and gentlemen, this is another episode of the FC Cincinnati Malish Career Mode. Today we're going to be trying to force our way out of the club or at least give ourselves the opportunity to hear from other teams. Um, we are 73 rated now. Uh, we did go ahead and try and put in our transfer request twice last episode because we are currently in 8th place and I said if we didn't make it to 7th, I was going to put in a transfer request. Again, that doesn't necessarily mean I'm for sure going to move, but it at least gives us the opportunity to talk to other teams. Um, but our manager has turned it down twice. So after this game, we will try to do another transfer request and um, see what we can do. I could have sat out of this game, honestly, and tried to see what would happen, but we'll play it. We'll keep our stats up, you know what I'm saying? Try to make us more attractive. But we probably will only play the first half of this. I'm very excited to be able to bring you live action from Major League Soccer coming right up. Ah, uh, Adi. That oh, pass was so know, bad, bro. Oh, God. I didn't mean to press that. To the fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end-to-end. -end. We could get goals today, Derek. Dangerous-looking attack. I'm curious how Cruz thought he was going to score that. I'm going to be honest with you. This is how it looks for I'm kind of confused. Would you call it 4-5-1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4-2-3-1, really. The two central midfield players. Can they get themselves in front Let's here? go, baby. 1-0. Scored in the first seven minutes. Me joy. demanding a transfer request does not mean I'm going to stop playing for this team. We're going to keep scoring goals. I think that's our seventh goal in the season. Four assists. We're absolutely killing it. Again, we're just trying to make ourselves more attractive for other teams. But look at that touch. Look at that shot. Side netting. You love to see it. Unsavable is what they would call it. And we're 1 0 up against Houston. Let's go, baby. And the cross goes in. Not really the ideal clearance. Why? Why make your job more difficult? Just take the damn ball. Why would you pass well, that to Kendola? Oh, Mane, thank you for not trying to do too much. Just have a shot. Almost. I am going to come out at halftime. I scored my goal. Pretty happy with that. Ooh, Greg. Almost. All right, that is going to be the end of the first half and the end of our game. This has been a pretty frustrating half um, since we scored. We didn't have a lot of chances there. You saw, Led or not Ledesma's, uh, Ulola's last chance at the end of the half. I always say his name wrong. I don't care anymore. Um, 45 minutes played, though. One goal. Obviously, our one shot. But... 85% passing, 18 touches, 12 passes completed, and one key pass. Definitely could have played better. Um, again, our positioning's not great, but that just comes with the way that I play center defensive mid, so that's okay. Um, let's go ahead and request our sub and see if we can manage to also get our transfer requested. The irony in the fact that we are requesting a transfer is that now we are actually in seventh place, um, but... That will not stop us. We were not there at the time that I wanted it to be. I have considered your request for a transfer and I've decided to grant your request. You will be added to the transfer list immediately and I shall let you know when an offer is suitable. Thank you. Again, that doesn't mean we're for sure going to leave. If a good enough offer doesn't come in, we will stick it out and play with the squad. So we have managed to get our transfer request in. As you see, uh, Samito went to Piemonte Calcio. Uh, the Juventus boys so that's a big that's actually a pretty big transfer um, but let's go ahead and hop into this game against uh, Chicago never know this could be our last game that isn't the worst kick clash but I don't like it so we're gonna go with that all right uh, so again, jumping into this game I believe we are playing in Chicago right yeah we're playing in Chicago so pretty big game here um, we obviously did save our stamina by coming out halftime last game see if we can grab another goal this could be you never know this could be our last game playing for Cincinnati if the right offer comes in fast enough so um, this is obviously a pretty big game we do want to manage to beat Chicago we are in seventh place right now so again if we end up staying that's totally fine because I do actually think we are capable of making 
making the playoffs with this team. Um, and as long as we can keep the good passing up, the good the good counter attack up, I'm not going to say good possession because we don't actually ever have possession. But if we can keep the counter attacking up, I think we'll be in a good spot. Mm, I wanted that over the top. The line up then for the hosts. Would you call it 4 5 1 Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4 2 3 1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them, and then a lone striker Ooh, with the number two. That was the worst him. header I have ever seen in my whole life. That's only our fifth cross that we've completed in our career so far. Um, but our ball skills went up, so that's cool. Uh, but yeah, that was pretty trash. That was actually quite possibly the worst header I've ever seen from Ledesma. He literally just had to hit it forward, well, but instead he kicked it in the air for some reason. And, a match winner, but this and it's stuff like that that does change. make me want to leave, because even if we do make the playoffs, I don't think there's a single chance in hell we could actually do anything in the playoffs. Um, it would be just more of a uh, token of our labor. Oh, get there. Aha, my ball. What if I go? Cruz. Nice flick from Cruz. Oh, I thought Ledesma could get there, but he never got on the inside. I probably could have just passed it to Adi, honestly. Just a little through ball to Adi. Oh, I'm captain? Wait, am I really? Or have I always been able to do that? Am I captain? No. Huh. But they gave me control of the... Uh... They gave me control of everything. I don't think I'm supposed to have control. I think that's a glitch. I'm not complaining. That is good to know. Nice ball. Go, oh, Adi. Shoot that. Oh, I almost got there. No! That was supposed to go to Adi! Oh, this game pisses me off so much so to, uh, sometimes. Sometimes. Asira. My guy is exhausted. I'll play a little bit of the second half at the end of this first. I am pretty tired, but we are having some decent opportunities. I think we're really, really close to scoring, so I think I'm going to try to stay in this game a little bit longer and see if we can milk out a win. All right, I am going to go ahead and request our sub out of this match. See what we can do. Oh, God. Elvis. Nice. Ooh, beautiful pass. Let's go, Mane. Cruz. Hit that first time, man. Oh, this team is so frustrating sometimes. If he would have just smashed it, I still don't think he would have scored, but at least it would have looked better than that. That is going to be the end of that match um, and the end of this episode. Let's see, just to make sure we'll simulate to the next game and, and see if we get an offer come in uh, for our transfer to a different team. Again, I'm only going to go to a playoff team in the MLS if we do stay in the MLS, um, because as of right now, we are in sixth place. Um, that could obviously change by the end of the season, but you never know. Uh, so I don't want to miss out on that opportunity. Atlanta United also has dropped down to sixth, but they have an opportunity to climb back up the table as well. Um, as of right now, we have seven goals, five assists, so we have been playing well. We could be, definitely be doing better, though. Um, we lost two games, won one, and drew one out of the last four. Our tackle success rate was awful, mainly because I was pressing circle to try to cut passing lanes and stuff, and if it didn't work, then it's a bad tackle, understandable, whatever. Um, let's see, so nothing too crazy, DC United, New England, Toronto, and then I missed a lot. I won't lie, but we did get an opportunity, we could go to France. 
Stad Rene wants us for 30k a week, which would be a lot more money than we're making right now. Um, a lot more money that, than we're making right now. I will stall this, though. I think. Yeah, we're going to stall it just to see if there's any other offers that come in. Um, I think offers last about a week, so we'll see. Uh, let's see. Did we get all the way to the next game? We did. So that is going to be the end of this episode. Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you think I should go to France to play at Stad? Now, what we can do is check to see if they're do if one if they're in League One or if they're in League Two, and then also how well they're doing right now. Because obviously, again, we don't want to go to a team that's not going to do well. Although, actually, thinking about it. They haven't even started their league. We could actually, it would be going to a brand new league. So let's see, uh, we go to pick competition. And league one. They are still in league one, right, Stad? Yeah, so we would be going at the beginning of league one. They haven't even started their season yet. So that would be the positive is it's a brand new season. We could have an instant impact in the team. Um, we have already hit our clean sheet quota for the, which is really good. And our stats are still looking pretty decent. But again, that is going to be the end of this episode. Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you guys want me to see? Uh, do you guys want to see me go to League One instead of playing in the MLS, or should I wait out and see if there's a better offer still available? Other than that, I hope you guys did enjoy. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy. And until the next one, I'll see you guys later. Peace.